Hello everybody. Happy Wednesday. And I am here. Oh, I forgot to say who I am. It's Mel from Melamore Nursery. And I am here. I'm back with sweet little Garth, who is the Chase Skull by Bonnie Brown that I adopted from Annie over at Annie Banani's Nursery. Now folks, this is take two. It's take two. And yes, I am, you know, uh, doing it again because I noticed that the timestamp was in the wrong direction so you would have seen it like vertically not horizontally and yeah so when I realized that okay so here we are we're doing it again I wanted to bring Sweet Chase back on um, or Garth I should say because it is Shara's hashtag today on Wednesdays we wear pink and I do not believe I have ever brought a little boy on for on Wednesdays we wear pink I don't think I ever have and I thought Annie had sent home such a wardrobe with this little boy it was a perfect example for me to showcase some of the colors that his coloring really matched based on what she'd sent home and um, of course, I'd said a whole bunch of other stuff and finished the whole video and then realized, of course, yep, Mel moment. I got to start another book of Mel moments, let me tell you. <laughs> so the outfit I have for Sweet Garth, who reminds me of a very, very young Garth Brooks, in a way. I mean, I imagine him growing up to be a famous country singer. And I don't know, there's just something about his coloring, something about, oh, just how his hands are and his face is as if he's already like thinking up ways in which, you know, uh, he could change the world if he could, you know, and yet these are expressions of a, a, of a normal uh, baby even though this is a reborn doll. I like to do this, folks. I like to build personalities into my dolls. It's very uh, common for me to do it with the open-eyed dolls, rarely with closed-eyed dolls. So let me get on with this and show you the outfit I want to put on him. Now, of course, I've cut the tag off because this is take two. Um, but it is a Carter's outfit, just one new, and it's a newborn outfit. It was brand, brand new, brand spanking new, and it is a rusty colored romper, uh, uh, rust colored, and like, oh, I don't know, gray, muted white, something like that, and uh, like rust and salmon colored, but right up here on the dump truck, you will see there's pink. There's also yellow here for the tractor and green here for the, I don't know what they call that truck. And um, the back is plain. So we'll put that on him and we'll take off this other gorgeous outfit, which I've changed him already. Now I've reweighted him once um, and I did mean to reweight him again for a flop factor. That's all. Um, and I haven't done that yet. I haven't gotten to that yet. Busy, busy, busy with appointments and schedulings and other things. Um, but really it comes down to priorities. Uh, sweet baby Garth hasn't been the top of my priority at the moment. I've got a few of them. In fact, I've got a book full, a list full. I think it's three pages long full <laughs> of priorities. But, um, I was talking about in my um, in my other video about how his face looks like. You know, he has a hard life. <laughs> and then I thought of the song, It's a Hard Not Life, from Annie. You know, the musical Annie, the TV show or the movie or uh, the theater, theatrical production. And then I was saying, you know, oh, I don't really enjoy too, too many musicals. However, I do love Annie and I do love uh, Grease. Those are my favorite two. And if you've been uh, watching my channel this week, um, I've been asking, you know, for certain, you know, comments in the commentary box. And, and the reason for that will all come. But what I'm looking for today, folks, 
is what is your favorite um, musical? Do you have one? Uh, or do you not like them at all? Um, there's certain ones that I really like and certain ones that I really just don't like at all. And, um, okay, honey bunny, let's get my hand under there so we can get this off your hand. So, yeah, in the comments, if you wouldn't mind, write down if you like musicals. And if you do, which ones do you like? He won't be needing this undershirt. We're going to get him so simple. Simply dressed, I should say. And that way you guys can all see him. He's a beautiful little boy. Beautiful little boy. And like I said, I don't think I have ever brought on a boy for on Wednesdays. We wear pink. But he has pinkies, hands and feet. He's got the coloring of a true redhead boy. And he's been painted beautifully. And we don't have much sun that comes in today. And certainly not today. It's overcast. I had to leave for one appointment wearing literally two sweaters and a jacket. And even though it's 11 degrees, it doesn't feel like 11 degrees Celsius. Of course, I'm in Canada. That We do it by degrees um, Celsius, so not by Fahrenheit. So since this outfit doesn't have any snaps at the top, and I am certain his hair is monorooted, and boy, is he ever, like, painted well. Look at all this glorious painting on his face. I'll bring him up close to you all so you can see. He is just painted beautifully. Such a wonderful job. Look at his little feet. It's gorgeous. Yeah, all the specs are in his box opening. And his box opening, I think, is the last box opening I had on my channel. I did have an introduction to the twin girls. And I have to bring those on soon. Um, again. And that will come. Come here, little boy. But in the meantime, I wanted to get this video up before I had to leave for my other appointment, to which... I know now I am going to be running like in super fast speed getting out the door because I just popped home to get paperwork essentially and thought, oh, I'll just do a quick 10 minute video. Well, when you know it, uh, when it was finished, I noticed that another Mel moment had happened. Yep. And that was another video I had done. Why is your diaper always slipping off, little man? I don't get that. He must, like, squirm around a lot because his diaper, like, comes off a lot. But we're not going to even, we're not going to go there because obviously he's a kicker. He's a kicker, a thomper, and a romper. And that's, you know, <laughs> the true signs of a country star in the making right here. Um, Gar Sanders is his name. And I think it really suits him. So I want to thank you again, Annie, because he's a beautiful little boy. And I want to thank you, Shara, for on Wednesdays we wear pink because obviously little Garth is wearing some pink on his outfit. And I didn't bring him a small little lovey, although um, you will see his lovey is right over there. His little koala bear that she sent with him. So he is definitely just a gorgeous little boy. Oh my goodness. He's got Nilia on the nose. He's gorgeous with eyebrows. Like he's just, he's just spectacular. He's got beautiful uh, varnish on him. He's just magical. This little boy. He is. Well, folks, um, like I said, uh, if you've made it to the end and you feel like commenting, right? What musical you enjoy? And, and um, also whether you like them or not, because a lot of people don't. And, you know, at first, you know, if, if I was to be asked, do I like musicals? I mean, I, I'd want to say no. But actually, when I, when I stop and I count the, the movies that are musicals that I actually enjoy, the answer is not no. So, yeah. 
So anyway, folks, I want you to remember, please, that we were all perfectly imperfect. You are all loved, wanted, and needed far, far more than you will ever know. And I will see you next time. I look forward to all your comments. Please have a safe, beautiful, and blessed day. Bye for now.